The people who have resigned from the Trump administration thus far over the president inciting yesterday's attack on the Capitol, it's kind of a weird list. The White House social secretary, the first lady's chief of staff, a deputy in the White House press office, the deputy national security advisor, the chair of the Council of Economic Advisors, which is a thing that doesn't actually exist anymore. He was the only one left. Uh, the administration's envoy to Northern Ireland, who used to be White House chief of staff, also a senior cybersecurity guy. And now two members of the Trump cabinet. Just in the last few minutes, the education secretary, Betsy DeVos, has announced her resignation. That's now been confirmed by NBC News. That came after the resignation earlier today from Transportation Secretary Elaine Chao. Secretary Chao, of course, married to the top Republican in the Senate, Mitch McConnell, which makes it maybe more interesting than your run-of-the-mill cabinet resignation. But, you know, you, want, you might ask, with Betsy DeVos and Elaine Chao now resigning, if they were so troubled by the president's behavior, one other option would have been to stay in the cabinet and whip votes there for the invocation of the 25th Amendment to remove the president from power. 